So what we want to have a look at this morning is how you would go about requesting a compliance report for audit purposes um, from the, the uh, Farmer app on your phone. So we select Dashboard, we slide across to um, the next page which will bring up your compliance report. We simply go ahead and tick the compliance report button and then we select the plans that we want to request uh, compliance reports from. So um, at the moment it's selected all plans. I don't want to select all plans because I know that some of these don't have enough information in them. I'm just going to deselect some of these and have a plan that I know that if I ask it to activate stuff, there's, there's, um, there's compliance report information in it. So I'm going to save that. It's going to ask me from the start month for the compliance and I'm going to go and ask it for anything from January this year through to the end of July. The recipients is, will be uh, yourself, the farmer in this case. If you wanted to add a contact from within the group, you can do so. Or if you wanted to add a non-contact to receive that compliance report, and maybe that's someone from within your meat company, then you just select this button here. You put in the name and their email, and that'll go to them at, at the same time it comes to you. So we're not going to do that today. Once you've selected the plan, you've selected the recipients, it's just a matter of pushing submit, and it's going to say that the next time that you sync, that that um, will automatically come through to you. So we just go OK there. We come back across at the return button, and you just need to hit the synchronisation button here, and that should go through the process of completing the sync, and while it's doing that, it'll pick the information up and it'll turn up in your email box as soon as that sync is completed. It's as easy as that.